Hillary Clinton's assertion that Donald Trump is an illegitimate president. I believe he knows he's an illegitimate president. He knows. He knows that there were a bunch of different reasons why the election turned out the way it did. And I take responsibility for those parts of it that I should. But Jane, it was like applying for a job and getting 66 million letters of uh, recommendation and losing to a corrupt human tornado. And so I know that he knows that this wasn't on the level. I don't know that we'll ever know everything that happened, but clearly we know a lot and are learning more every day and history will probably sort it all out. So of course he's obsessed with me and I believe that it's a guilty conscience in so much as he has a conscience. The controversy surrounding this issue is intense, sparking debates about the potential harm to democratic principles and processes. Some view it as an effort to undermine Donald Trump's presidency and by extension, the voices of his supporters. Others see it as a testament to the public's concern for the integrity of the electoral process and the necessity of accepting election outcomes. Hillary Clinton's comments are often seen as exacerbating political polarization and fostering distrust in the electoral system, troubling those who prioritize stability and respect for democratic results. Her labeling of Trump as a guilty concern is also contentious perceived by many as an unfounded attack on his character, without solid proof, further inflaming partisan divides. The way these investigations impact public trust, the political climate, and societal divisions is now a pressing issue.